Hello, this is the moderator Antonia Quinones. I'm here on my left with Robert Walters, director of the groundwork at, at the Science Barge in downtown Yonkers. Welcome. Welcome. And thank you for having us. Now, welcome, Antonia. It's my pleasure to have you on the Science Barge. Thank you. I wanted to ask you, uh, being that we're here and we have a scenic uh, picture here of the mountain, the, the, the Inglewood Cliffs, Cliff Mountains, as well as we're out in the Hudson River, how did you start this uh, project? It's interesting that the Science Barge is a floating urban farm. We teach about using sustainable energy for growing vegetables in the city. Yes. So it was actually a company that called Sunworks that started the Science Barge, and they were environmental engineers showing that this type of technology of using sustainable energy, supporting sustainable agriculture in the city worked. So Groundwork Cuts and Valley operates the barge now. Beautiful. And is the community, the community involved in this? Do you have children coming in to, uh, to work, work with you? I, how does I, it, how does it yeah, I look at this as a community center mm -hmm. because we welcome the people from the neighborhood on the board. I think that's an important part of what we do. Yes. And we're in downtown Yonkers, we're on the Hudson River, and we have this beautiful setting on the river. So it's wonderful to bring the people from the neighborhood. And they know more about farming sometimes than I do because they have grown vegetables in their lives. Now, can you tell me how do you work this solar? Yeah, come on down. Come on down and we'll take a look. Okay. Let's see. Do we want to get the solar panels in the back? Yes. You're going to have to come this way, dear. Oh, no, you're not okay. You're okay. You're just <laughs> Don't tell get, me. You just... Mr. Robert. And tell me about these solar panels and what do they do? The solar panels supply 80% of our electricity on the science barge to run the hydroponic greenhouses. So the neat thing about these panels is they produce 2,500 watts of electricity, but they're like a sunflower. They track the sun. Mm. So at the end of the day, they'll be facing the palisades. Then in the morning, the sun comes up, and it's almost like magic. They flip over and follow the sun. So it's an interesting system. It's called passive tracking, so the, the panels are 20% more efficient than the panels that are mounted on roofs. So, and, they, and they bring in energy. Yeah, they make electricity, they make uh, 72 volt DC, and then we have an inverter that transforms it to 110 AC, which we, what we use in the greenhouse. Beautiful. And now I see the windmills. Up this way, can yeah, you tell me a yeah. little bit about that? Yep, yeah. you know. Now you're gonna, yeah, go come this way, cut 